everybody, it's your boy Hit Me Wild here on the Chill Town Show. Episode 10. How did any finger cutting thing? Anyways, who do we have on today? Today we have this beautiful lady, her name's Kajira. She's a belly dancer, in fact, her company, she created her own style of belly dancing. I guess you can call her the black sheep of belly dancing. There she is, an international, worldwide star of belly dancing. In fact, she, we're so lucky to get her on today's episode. Episode 10 of the Chill Town Show with your boy, M.B. Wild. Check it. Hi, I'm Kajira Jumana, and I teach travel belly dance and produce the world's first and largest travel belly dance festival. I started by looking in a rec center's program for various classes, and I had been taking other kinds of movement forms, from jazzercise to hula to flamenco, and I saw a thing for belly dance, and I thought, well, I'll go try that. I had never seen a belly dancer before, had no idea what it was about, but from the very first class, I knew I was hooked. I'm inspired by my students a lot. As a teacher, uh, I have students around the world. I'm so lucky I get to fly all around and teach all over the place in different countries. And that keeps me extremely inspired, also by the performers at my festival and the teachers that I invite. It's a real big deal and I'm always amazed at the talent and creativity that goes into the alternative belly dance scene. I've traveled to Taiwan four times so far, I'm England four times and I'm going back this August, Austria twice, Germany three times with my fourth time coming up this June, and all over the US and Canada. Also, I've been to Mexico twice to teach belly dance. I just returned from Italy this last fall where I stayed for over two weeks. Tribal Fest is the world's first alternative and all tribal belly dance event in the world. It's five days long now and it has uh, three days of show non-stop. Almost 200 acts come on stage, including live music and recorded music with the dancers all non-stop. There are oh, about 50 vendors selling goodies from around the world for, for tribal and alternative lifestyles and dance. And I have 46 teachers with 66 different offerings this year. I'm glad you asked. Tribal style is a fairly new form. It started in America about 25 years ago in San Francisco. And it's unique in the whole world of dance because it has synchronized group improvisation. So the dancers don't need to learn a set choreography. They learn structured movements with cues that tell the other dancers what's going on. And the dancers trade, lead, and follow positions throughout the show in an ever-changing dynamic mosaic of art created on the spot. We also use ethnic textiles and um, costuming, so we don't have the, the beaded, glitzy look of Egyptian cabaret or American-style cabaret, but instead we have uh, things like made of cottons and velvets and brocade. We use mirrors and antique metal. And um, our jewelry usually comes from India and Afghanistan, North Africa, as well as some finds from the flea market. I say get on the internet and start looking for belly dance websites and tribal belly dance websites. Put in tribal belly dance and just check out what comes up. Get on YouTube, put in tribal fest and you can see lots of examples of tribal and alternative belly dance including group and solo forms, choreographed and not, uh, from the last 12 years of tribal fest and um, just search, search, search. Everybody's online these days. There are also trade magazines specific to tribal and just general belly dance. I write for one called Zagarit, and there's another called Fuse that's just for tribal belly dance. They should go to blacksheepbellydance.com. 
I'm Kashira Jumana, and you're watching the Chill Town Show. That's my girl Kajira, beautiful lady, awesome, thank you. Uh, check her out, check her website out, I believe they put a link somewhere, here, there, somewhere. Um, she's got DVDs, instructional videos, or I think she has a YouTube stuff, does she? Does she? Does she? No? Yes? Are you agreeing with me? Stop zooming in on my face! Anyways, that... That was a little too close for comfort. <laughs> we got our own time. Once again, for the Almighty, and I'm wondering who that dark, dark guy is. Who that, who that guy is? Flash Wind Flame. The Adventures of Flash Wind Flame. Beamstar has been kidnapped by the evil Shadow. Flash is on the move, looking for his dear friend. How was that? Funny, huh? <laughs> Anyways, that's a funny door in my face. Anyways, check it out. I would like to thank everybody for watching us here on uh, the Chill Town Show, episode 10. It's your boy, Happy Wild. Don't forget to uh, subscribe to us here on YouTube uh, or follow us on Twitter. Uh, right there's the link. Or you can follow my boy, DJ Blast, at. Follow him on Twitter at DJ Blast Maui. You listen to him, your dad listens to him, your kids are gonna listen to him. Check it out. Uh, once again, well spoken, thank you, sir. Uh, or you can like us on Facebook. Like I said, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, subscribe to us, look at our old episodes like 9 to 1, 1 to 9, well, now 10. Uh, I am your boy, no longer a man. Happy Wild. I'm out. What? Peace, I'm out! Peace and be wild. Poke.